now a bitch can shine. Now a bitch can shine. Okay, let's let's get let's get it. Now a bitch can shine like she's supposed to shine. Day two. Mm-hmm. Day two. Day two. Day two. Y'all be liking my posts and stuff, bitch. Y'all know what this is giving. Y'all already know what this is giving. Y'all already know what this is giving. See, now a bitch can shine. Now a bitch can shine without having, you know, conversations, bitch, from the peanut gallery and all of the things. Hi. Hello. Hey. What's up? What's the going? Ooh, it's thirsty getting ready. Hi. Hello. What is going on? Hello. 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 I see people creeping and sneaking and creeping in. Hi. Say hello. Be polite. <laughs> Be polite. Say hi. I gotta wait for this freaking thing to catch up. I'm just gonna sit here for a minute and um until the people start coming in. Please as you're coming in, please share across your things. Um I got a lot to talk about today and stuff. Hello, hello. Is anybody there? If you can hear me, say I. Hello, everybody. What is going on? What is going on? Bitch, I got to listen. Oh, don't, don't think this is going to be a polite live because it's not. <laughs> Do not think that this is going to be a polite live because it's not. Because the thing about it is, is that a lot of this purging, bitch, is coming from, bitch, me suppressing a lot of things that I wanted to say and needed to say and didn't say out of, you know. See, and this is the thing about telling the truth. Bitch, sometimes the truth is ugly. And sometimes, you know, many times people don't like to listen to nor see what's in front of their fucking face. Hello, what's the goings? Hey, what's going on, Yolanda? Hey, hey. Well, at least I know somebody's comments is working. <laughs> hey, what's going on? What is going on? What is up? 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 See, now listen. I don't expect many people to be on here today. You know, on this Saturday, um, late afternoon or whatever. But um, I'm going to say what I have to say, bitch. And then I'm going. If you are not following me on Bego, what are you doing? Follow me on um, Icon the MB Pro on Bego. And, you know, I relax, unwind, you know, whatever I'm feeling. We have great discussions. Shout out to Nicole for our conversation last night. It was tops. And, um, you know, the girls that have crossed over, bitch, are starting, are starting to finally fucking seep through and come through. You know what I mean? Because, Nicole, I know you out there, you'll probably watch this later. But, bitch, you cannot tell me that Deja was not on that phone call last night. And another thing, I was coming out of the shower today. I was visited by Renee Caron. Like, see, the thing about it is, what y'all don't get about me, bitch... Is that I am spirit, bitch? I am navigating in my, in, I'm navigating spirit. And for those that navigate spirit, bitch, it is extremely, extremely, extremely complicated, bitch, because you can't see spirit. You can't see someone's spirit. The only way you can see someone's spirit, bitch, is through their actions. So please share this live. I'm just going to be, you know, on here for a little bit. 
Hi, everybody that's coming in. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. What is the going? <laughs> you know, um, and, and, and those who are gifted and, and spiritually in tune with themselves and things like that, you know what I mean. You know, now I'm just gonna what? I'm sorry, I'm giving some. Pay no mind, pay no mind. How am I supposed to pay you no mind are you talking? Pay me no mind. <laughs> pay me no mind. What is that? It's just something here? Uh, Thank you. <laughs> Anyway, so, okay, I made a post earlier about little Kevin, and the thing about it is what people don't feel, people feel to realize about me is that now I am turning around the mirror. Hey, what's going on, Jemiah? Hey, beautiful. I hope you're having a beautiful day, and I hope you're having a great and blessed, amazing weekend. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it, DeMarco. Thank you. Hi. Yeah, so far, so good. You know what I mean? But, <coughs> excuse me. And I know to a lot of you that I might seem, like, bitter and, and, and all of the things. And, you know, it seems like I'm unpacking a lot of shit and all of that. And, bitch, let me tell you something. Bitch, me doing all of this, bitch, is necessary, bitch, for my next fucking level. I can't move on until I release a lot of the things associated with the space I just left from. And for those of you who follow me and that are close to me and that I speak to on the regular, you know that. You know what I mean? Now, I am strong enough. I'm strong enough, bitch, and, you know, in my spirit and who, and based off of my spirit and who I am. Bitch, to comfortably go to my next level knowing that I left a lot of fucking shit behind and a lot of people are behind along with it. You know? And I encourage a lot of y'all to pay attention to your own platforms too. Because bitch, let me tell you something, bitch. When you pay attention and you actually see and look at how a lot of these bitches move and shake, Bitch, you'll have a whole new outlook. You'll have a whole new outlook. Because everybody says that social media is not real. But bitch, let me tell you something. A lot of people post what they fucking think. Hey, what's going on? Thank you. Hey, sister. Sister. I just posted our pick from Girls United the other day, too. You've been on my mind. You know what I'm saying? And the thing about it is, is that like I said yesterday, honey, it's about the girls for me. It's always been about the girls. And bitch, yes, exactly. Exactly, Will. Out with the old and in with the new, new. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And... So, my gripe, I'm just going to get right into it. My gripe that I had with Miss Kevin is that he is always sticking his freaking wide ass nose, surge nose in the business that does not belong to him. You know what I mean? And it's not based off the post that he posted I screenshot yesterday when I was on live. It was simply because that any gripe that I have with an individual, here he comes giving his opinion. One thing that I can't stand that people that are close to me know that please do not police how I act or react to something when I'm being disrespected. That oversurge queen last year, bitch, talked about my dead mother, bitch, and I'm online defending myself by myself. And here you go coming in here with your opinions on, oh, trying to be a fucking mediator when the fucking situation don't even concern you. See, this is the thing. People are too busy minding each other's fucking business. And 
and the thing about it is also also um um also mirror you know what the thing about it is too with, with social media the thing about it is is that i've given so many people i've given so many people the opportunity to do that I've given so many people the opportunity to do that. You know what I'm saying? I've given people so many opportunities. So then, when you get to a point to where you can't take it no more, bitch, and I'm like a fucking cannon just fucking spitting everything out, bitch, and not caring, then everybody wants to come back around and double back and be like, well, what's wrong with Naomi? One thing about Niambi, Niambi has never had a, you know, I used to have an issue with speaking up. And that's why a lot, that, that's why a lot of this purging is coming out now. Because I was stupid. And when I was feeling uncomfortable, I didn't speak up. When it was something that I didn't like, I didn't speak up. So now that I'm in a space, place in space, bitch, where I'm in control of my own narrative, bitch, I'm going to be speaking up. Look, I just talked my sister up. Hey, Nicole, I love you. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm in a space and place where, honey, don't nothing move me now. Because bitches wasn't out here, bitch, maneuvering based off of my, uh, off of my empathy and sympathy. So why should I maneuver off of theirs? Why should I care about feelings when people don't give a fuck about mine? It makes no sense. So now, starting yesterday, I am moving in a space and place where, pe where, where people... Hey, Auntie Tanae, I love you. Hey, Tim Tim, I love you. Hey, sister. So now I'm moving in a place and space where, bitch, where the love is given, the love will be returned. And if it's the opposite of love, bitch, that's what you're getting in return. And please don't complain when you get even, you know what I mean, when you get that from me. Because it's so crazy how people will try to silence you when you feel fucked up about something or when you're hurt. Or, and people walk around here like fucking uh, 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 robots. Like they have no fucking feelings. But that's not me. And I do. And I do. Because it was about releasing things that don't, that, that don't serve a purpose. That have no purpose. It was a waste of time. <laughs> so your new name is Mirror Got It. Exactly. <laughs> Bingo. Bingo. Because at the end of the day, that man got up on my thing on my live last night, honey. While it was all in Florida and was like, okay, okay, um, let's get back to the, what we was doing. Okay, we wish you well. Okay, bye. Bitch, after 22 fucking years, okay. You let me know right there, bitch, how expendable and disposable me and a lot of the girls are. And I can see why a lot of the, the girls that was in that house stated. And see, what we also realize is that, what we also forget is, is that how the envy was around for your motherfucking beginnings in the scene. With your wide ass nose chasing after Alyssa and sucking up Miss Angel's ass. See, you forget I was there for that. People get into a certain place in space and don't humble themselves. There's a lot of humility that needs to go on in this scene because Niambi was there for that. Niambi was there when you were a knot and a rock. And in some places and spaces you still are. Because if you was if it was not for you being man child, you would have not gotten as far as you've gotten in ballroom. Let's start telling the truth. Let's start telling the truth. Thank you, Mira. Humble beginnings. 
And people get to, people let this fucking clout and the, and, and, and the people build them up to a fucking point. One thing about me, I have always been the envy. I've hung with the fed people. I've hung with the rocks. Hell, I used to be a rock. And a brick and a boulder and all of the things. So, bitch, what we not going to do, bitch, is feel fab on my time. I can give a fuck about anybody else, but they're not going to feel fab on my time. Thank you, Tim Tim. People that ego stunt, they grow. Yes, they do. And especially, especially the part where ballroom and all of the things like, we're all joined now. Like, everything is all meshed together now. Hey, Veronica, what's going on? Um, everything is, everything, is, we are all joined by the internet now. So, you have people that have names in ballroom. Hey, Ski. Um, you have people that are involved in ballroom, not involved in ballroom. People with, with names and have done things, spectators. You have, we have, like, it's a all, where it's all intermingling together. And that's why a lot of these, and the thing about it is, that's why ballroom is so watered down is because it's too accessible. It's too accessible. And that is one of the main reasons why <coughs> you know what I mean like like I'm go like I'm going in a different direction. My love will always be for ballroom, but it will always be for the history. The truth and the history behind it. The truth and the history behind it. You know what I'm saying because People get people get these freaking in, 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 in inflamed egos, bitch. Like baby, as fast as time goes, bitch, I could go like this, bitch, and go back to a freaking time, bitch, where honey, you was a a young motherfucking queen running around here, bitch, trying to latch yourself onto a fucking femme queen. Okay. Did you forget, bitch, I was around for the house of Asante that Alyssa started, bitch, and you and you was her son before you became man's daughter? I guess you forgot that. Did you forget about your best friend Timmy that got killed, bitch, the one that I got a picture with in the Nile? Shortly after she transitioned? I was there for that. Renee Twizzler, you Angel Alyssa Carey, yes. See, these are the things that motherfuckers forget. I haven't forgotten because it's a part of my culture and my history. But you want to be condescending and wave me off, bitch, like I don't matter, bitch, like I didn't give the majority of my life to motherfucking Prodigy and Ebony? The nerve of the girls. The nerve of the boys. Because <laughs> we just want to start telling the truth here. We just want to start telling the truth here. Everybody that knows me in the advocacy, advocacy space, that's the advocacy space. Ballroom is fucking ballroom. So let me tell you something, bitch. We are gonna start calling the guys the guys and the motherfucking girls the girls because we don't live the same life, bitch. We're not the same. We are not the same. And a huge reason why I've decided to go on, bitch, just being the enemy. I'm comfortable with that. And as quick as y'all got me out of that group, I can see that y'all are comfortable with it too. And that's fine.
But I'm letting y'all know what we will not do. What we will not do is try to make, to, to paint the picture that the Abby is fucking delusional over all these years. Like she didn't experience all of the things that she did all these years. Nicole, are you still in them comments? Are you still in them comments? Let me know because I'm bringing you up. If you are. Because it's time to unpack this. So I can move on. So I can emotionally and mentally move on. From a lot of the triggers that have happened. Within a space with so-called family. Hey, Sean, how are you? So while um, Nicole, while Nicole is um, getting it together, hopefully, if she's still in the comments, um, you know, I got booted out of the ball. See my, yes, I know. But see, the thing about it is, is that people only have the power you give them. And this is what I try to get a lot of y'all to realize. People only have the power you give them. If anybody knows my cash app, could they post it in the comments so I can pin it, please? It is cash tag learn your history. Facebook will not let me pin it, so I need somebody to put it in the comment section. Because time is valuable to me. Thank you, baby. <sighs> hey, as long as I had the real girls, I was good. Yeah, it's a, it's a different thing. And what I am here to do is bring the respect back to the girls where it fucking belongs. Happy birthday to Marsha P. Johnson. Because I'm here to bring the respect back to the girls. Because a lot of these examples of the girls or the dolls or whatever the one fuck you want to call them or whatever. Bitch, a lot of these examples ain't exampling. I'm just saying. And that's no shade to nobody. But a lot of the examples aren't exampling. And it's too much disrespect amongst the girls, especially the ones who have been out here and doing it and freaking paved the way for a lot of people. Hey, Dink, what happened to the respect for the history? Ego, period. Wanting to be a gatekeeper, wanting to be in control of things. But no matter how much the powers that be want to center themselves, bitch, I'll always be here teaching history. The history from my perspective, from the time that I came out, which was 1992, up until, you know, up until when ballroom fucking started going downhill. Because I don't recognize none of this shit now. But what I won't have is people that know my history feeling it on my fucking time. Like I have not contributed. And like I have not done what I've done. I won't have it. I won't have it. Because, bitch, let me tell you something. I've got Quran under my belt. 
I've got Ebony under my belt. I've got Vinazini under my belt. And I've got Prodigy under my belt. Bitch, I am all of them. I am all of them. And will forever be all of them. I will forever be all of them. Thank you, Didi. I will be... I will, I will, I will forever be all of them. And what I've done can't nobody take the fuck away, bitch. No matter how much they try to water down and try to ignore facts. Facts are still facts, bitch, whether you ignore them or not. Facts are still facts. And what I can't understand is how people can get to a certain point, bitch, and then try to freaking act delulu. But will project onto you, bitch, like you the fucking delusional one. Bitch, if you don't get the fuck out of my freaking thing, get out. Fuck out. All I'm saying is beware. All I'm saying is I gave se I gave bitches seven years. And yeah, I already said, oh, <laughs> you know, I'm quick. Tamira, I am quick. That y'all been going. For at least 10, 15 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm quick. I get some out of here. Because this shit is a, see, and this is why I, this is why I, I have to I I have to explain to y'all too about that. What Facebook and all of this freaking live shit? This is this is why I'm so well versed in AI, artificial intelligence, and things like that. Facebook is not run by people no more. They will send bots into your lives and post shit like that based off of your hashtag. Where the fuck is she at? Yup, because she she got another one. There she go. Boom. Again, 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 and again. Girl. Got her again. Yeah, it's 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 run by AI. Which is which which that just proved my point. Like, bitch, this shit is not run by pe people no more. It's run by AI. So they will send bots into your lives. To spam it. So just watch out for that. As you navigate the internet. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and. <laughs> yes. Yes. I don't, I ain't play. And, and the thing, and the thing about it is while people were out here, while people were out here reading me, I was studying. I was studying technology. And e-commerce. And how business online works. And all of the things. Because while people were trying to keep me into this box. See what you're looking at now is my Virgo rising. It's the second day of... of, of, of sec, I mean my Virgo, my Virgo rising. It's the second day of Virgo season. And bitch, I'm just getting started. I am just getting started. You know what I mean? I'm concentrating on shit like uh, uh, getting this lady into office, uh, uh, into the presidency. Like I'm doing important things that have an effect on our livelihoods. I am a Libra. My birthday is the 26th of next month. But who I am spiritually is Virgo. Attention to detail. 
business minded and all of the things and I am laser focused. I am laser focused and I cannot have a bunch of jealous motherfucking fags and drags, bitch. Be, be, you know what I mean? With their eyes of fucking jealousy on me. I can't have it. I cannot be in proximity of no one that does not miss, wish me well. And for those of you who are in ballroom, y'all know that there's a lot of hating ass, jealous motherfucking bitches in that space. Y'all know that. Y'all know that. And what's even worse is these people come concealed and use things like, like we are literally going through spiritual warfare right now. Like, bitch, these people come concealed like wolves in sheep's clothing. Using things like history and how long they've known you and family and things like that. And trigger words to play on your empathy and sympathy. As a person who has had to navigate the entire scene without a mother figure. Because I have always been the one born to be the caretaker and the, the and, and taking care of people. And keep taking care of those I love. Now I am at a place in space where it's time to take care of me. And for those who are with me, welcome. For those who are not, get out of my way. For those who are with me, they are with me. And for those who are not, get out of my way. And I'm not coming on here chaotic. And I'm speaking in a calm tone. And all of that because I know how sensitive a lot of you out there are. Because those who are sensitive have really never had anyone to tell you things the way that they actually are. They've always beaten around the bush and always tried to protect your feelings. No, you need to hear what you need to hear because you need to hear it. And there's a lot of people that are lying to people out here to spare their feelings. Thank you, Veronica. And yes, you have. We've known each other a lot of years. And it's so funny to me how so many people have so many negative things to say about me. But the people that I have been close to, that I have known, from back then, I still know and we're, uh, we're still close. And they still hold me in high regard. Like Veronica in this comment section right here. And a lot of my interactions and relationships with people last 10 and 20 and 30 years. When a lot of you that talk about me don't have relationships with people that last 10 to 20 to 30 minutes. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You know, it's it 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 just boggles my mind. And like I said earlier, I've given people, I have I have given people the opportunity. Like in my beginnings, when I was posting dead trans women, you know what I mean, getting killed out here, and 
You know what I mean? All the years and years and years I was saying, yeah, listen, we got this out here. We got that out here for the girls and stuff like that. I'm sharing resources and getting on panels and talking and talking and talking, getting on my own platform, getting on other people's platform and discussing issues that are important to us. Bitch, it was fucking cricket. But then people come when I when 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 I start beating my chest, then everybody wants to be like, oh well, bitch, why is she acting like that? Oh well, why is uh, uh. <laughs> because bitch compared to a company, bitch, you put. You put motherfucking, you put motherfucking 15, 20, 25, 30 years into a motherfucking company, okay? And then some bitch comes in here, bitch, um, maybe somebody that's had the boss or somebody that doesn't have as much experience as you, bitch, get that promotion that you've been vying for. You not going to feel some type of way? You're not going to feel no type of way. Because time is precious. You don't see all the people dropping like flies on your timelines every day, on your news feeds every day? Y'all don't see all the people dropping like flies, bitch? And that's why I will forever be with her. I will for always, I will always champ, champion for Kamala. You know why? Because when I see her, bitch, I see myself. When I see her, I see myself. And from a person, bitch, that used to walk up and down the streets of 13th Street in downtown Philadelphia, bitch, waving down cars to where I am sitting right now, bitch. I am a walking testimony. And instead of you bitches reading me, bitch, you need to be inspired. People like Tamara, Robin King, people like her, be inspired. It is time to remove this mask off of ballroom and stop moving and shaking off of your motherfucking egos and what you want motherfuckers to say about you. And moving off a of valid fucking nation when you don't, when a lot of you bitches out there don't even deserve the validation. You ain't did shit. All of the women that have paved the way and done things and shit like that, please. And done so many motherfucking things and have never gotten motherfucking adulation, bitch, or recognition and still haven't gotten recognition. And that's why I've made it my life's work to shine light on those people. So when motherfuckers ask me, what have I done? Bitch, look at my fucking history. That's why it's right at the bottom of the screen. Learn your history. You learn your history, you learn about me. And a lot of the other trendsetters in this scene that have that that have that have broken down barriers. Let me see what time is it. Okay, I still got it. Uh, I got about 
10, 15 minutes. So, with that being said, I have a line of little boy and little girl and cheerleaders, little boys and little girls in cheerleader skirts, bitch with cheerleader outfits on. Champion for Kamala to get her into Kamala to get her to get her into office. Uh, there we go. See, and, and the thing about it is, the more it comes through, I don't even address them no more. I don't even address them no more. Because you know why? Because, bitch, their curiosity is the reason why the fuck they're on my live in the first place. And, bitch, I will never interact with, motherfucker that, uh, with a motherfucker that don't have no motherfucking online identity, bitch. The bitches be coming on here, bitch, with motherfucking uh, uh, dog photos and shit. Dog photos, bitch, and no fucking face and, and, and all of that, bitch. I'm not interacting with that. That shit is beneath me. And see, this is what I was talking to y'all about access. And that's why I will be cutting off access to, uh, you know what I mean, to, to, to basically people in general unless you really rock with me like that. That person I just blocked don't know me. It's the fucking access that this shit provides. To let just anybody say anything that they want to you, bitch, with no fucking consequences. Veronica says, don't forget your beauty style <laughs> mouth. Yeah, that mouth, honey. Because let me tell you something. <laughs> and spirit, you may have that mouth, but it comes with the true gem heart. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. But the thing about it is, I, I you know, I, I, and I, I, I have to be humble about all of the, all, all of the bad experiences that I've had. Because if, bitch, if I've had all good experiences, bitch, I wouldn't know shit. And I wouldn't be able to give the advice that I that, that I give. Without the tough times, without bitches thinking that it's true to read me. But bitch, let me tell you something, bitch, they reading the wrong one. Bitch, especially bitch, honey, I walk hand in hand with AI and all of the things, bitch. Please. Well, let me tell you something, Veronica, as a person who I basically grew up with in the scene, bitch, we are walking testimonies. Me, you, Tamara, Nicole, uh, Denise. There's five right there. We are walking testimonies. We have been through the worst that this world has to offer and we're still here. And that deserves to be celebrated. And it deserves to be respected first. It deserves to be respected first. Veronica, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, Veronica. A lot of them don't care because they don't say shit. A lot of their silence equals violence. Because, bitch, there's a lot of them that don't say shit. And a lot of them are either too scared to say shit or they just don't care. Either way, that's not me. Because, bitch, if there's any injustice, bitch, I'm going to speak about it. Bitch, I stand on my astrological sign, bitch. I'm a Libra, bitch. I'm all about fairness. And if something's unfair, bitch, I'm gonna I'm gonna make it to where it's fair. 
by hook or by crook, it's going to be fair. So, with that being said, I am going to head over to Bego. For those of you who follow me over there, who would like to follow me over there, um, you can follow me over there at Icon Me and Be Pro. Um, you can donate to anything that I have going on. I have a GoFundMe that's up currently. I'm trying to raise $15,000 right now. I have a cash app for to donate directly, which is Learn Your History, which I named it based on as a love letter to Ballroom and its history. Um, you can also follow me on any of my platforms. I'm on TikTok, YouTube, Instagram, um, and all of the th and all of those things. Um, I have several businesses and nonprofits that are out there that cater to trans issues. You can follow trans information. Um, you can follow me at Trans Information. You can follow any of my businesses, the NBC's readings, where I do tarot card readings um, and talk about astrology and numerology for the new spiritual people that are out there. For those into technology, if you would like to get rid of your cable, I also do um, the, I, I work hand in hand with Amazon Fire Stick and I program Fire Sticks. So if you would like to get rid of your cable, you can contact me with that as well. Um, I also have a store, I also have a store, which is Learn Your History Merch, which, um, caters to all ballroom and customizable ballroom clothes and accessories and apparel. And, um, what is the last one? Oh, and the Ambi Product Designs. For those of you who would like to start a business, need a logo, graphic designing, um, websites and all of that, business cards flyers, whatever have you, you can reach out to me through the inbox for that as well. This is who I am now. So for those of you who would like to still continue to keep me in this box, oh, and little Kevin, I have not forgotten about you. Your um, caricature will be out next week. I guarantee you it will have a big nose. And um, yeah, because you need to be humbled and I'm the one that can do it. Um, let's see. And I think that's about, I think that's about it. I hope everyone had, um, finishes having a, one, a wonderful day, um, a prosperous day, an abundant day, and all of the things. And I, let me tell you something, no matter how much I read, no matter how much I read, I will always lead with love. No matter what these bitches say about me, bitch. This is just the beginning. Day two. And um, if all goes well, I will see y'all again tomorrow. Talk to you soon. Learn your history. See y'all soon. Love you.